What is going on guys? It is your boy Dismo here. So in this video, you guys are gonna be watching a double deatomizer strike on core KC or kill confirmed on Genesis, playing the Genesis playlist, and I was in a two-man party with my uh, good friend AK and I absolutely tore it up in this game. I believe I did choke a triple deatomizer. I think I died on a like another 15 or another like 13 which really isn't a choke but uh i still was on a good streak and then i died to i don't remember what i died to but i'm using the new k-bar variant the bunker buster i'll throw my class setup on screen now i believe in this gameplay because uh, i'm not looking at the class setup right now but i believe in this gameplay what i was rocking was the suppressor the quick draw grip and that is it and then i used i believe it was ghost hardline scavenger and dead silence that's my normal perks when i'm running three attachments and i just absolutely tore it up this game i love this gun so much it's actually my favorite nuke variant as of right now just because of how just like it's like well balanced in my opinion so is the mv4 and i like how this gives a new aspect or a new like way for you guys to watch some deatomizer strikes because it's not just the mv4 every single time now this gun is absolutely amazing in hardcore as well and i think with this class setup it can help you guys get a deatomizer strike if you haven't already and if you guys are torn between buying the mv4 fallout and the k-bar bunker buster in my opinion they're both very very good weapons to buy it doesn't matter which one you pay for but uh if i were to pick a one i would pick the k-bar as of right now if you like to kind of like play inside the map and push a little bit more because it's relatively decent at close quarters it has a bit of recoil that's why i put grip on it and has still a decent amount of recoil going at long range opposed to the fallout which has a built-in grip already and it kind of saves you from having to run a grip but that's what i like about the k-bar has built in extended mags so i don't have to run extended mags it's kind of a love hate thing it's would you rather sacrifice having a grip and more recoil or have more ammo so both of these weapons in my opinion are good to use uh overall though i do enjoy using the k-bar a lot more and i think that's mainly just because of the simple fact that this is a newer weapon and I like using the newer variants. I remember when the Type 2 Atomic came out, I used that almost every single game for the longest time because I loved using it in a Kimbo and it was just a really strong weapon in my opinion. And uh, that's about all, it's a double deatomizer. We just got the first one right there. This was an, actually a three deatomizer game. Uh, my friend AK, he as well, he also got a deatomizer and then I got the double and then I sadly choked the triple, like I said. And I came in clutch for the uh, second deatomizer. The game was at like 93 or like 95 tags confirmed and I clutched it up and then we were able to call in all three deatomizers, but my last deatomizer didn't get any kills. So I was only able to get kills with one deatomizer. But at the end of the game, you hear it get called in. So that's about all for the gameplay. I hope you guys do enjoy that. And I just want to th thank you guys so much. I say I feel like I say this in every single video because I'm just so grateful of you guys. Literally, we gained like over like 130 subscribers yesterday and it was absolutely insane. We're right now, it's three days or four days if you count today and then if you count the next day and the next day, whatever, until the new years. And I hope everyone has had a good 2016. It's been an amazing 2016 for me as well. I've had a lot of ups and downs, but a lot of the stuff that I've gone through is really, really positive and I couldn't be more grateful of that. And we're about to hit 10,000 subscribers, and that's something that, like I've said in multiple videos, I never thought was gonna happen. I never thought it was gonna be possible because my original goal when I came in to play, uh, make YouTube videos was I wanted 500 subscribers in my first year on YouTube because I felt like that was a good solid goal. I'd watch a couple people and talk to some friends. They would say, yeah, I've been doing YouTube for like a year and a half and they were at like 300, 500 subscribers. So I was like, you know what, if I shoot for 500, I can get it. And what do you know, we're almost at 10,000 subscribers. It's been over a year since I started YouTube, but I started YouTube November 6th. That's when my first video was uploaded, but I remember I took it down. Uh, it's just because that's when Black Ops 3 came out. Because I remember the night Black Ops 3 came out, I uploaded a video. So that's how I know November 6th was my very first uh, time uploading a video. And so it's been almost a year and two months. And it's been an amazing 2016. Like, I, everything that I wanted to achieve in 2016, I achieved it and then I obtained it. For a prime example, Carnage Clan. Now, when I got into pub stomping, it was probably like mid-March, early April. 
maybe even mid-April too. And I didn't really know that much about pub stomping, and I just started jumping into it, and then I found out about Carnage Clan, and then I was just like, I want to join. Now, at that time, Carnage was kind of done recruiting people, and I was told by multiple people that I have to wait until the next Call of Duty to recruit, get recruited into Carnage, but I didn't believe that, and I kept grinding, and I kept going for it, and what do you know, literally in September, two months before the new Call of Duty came out, I joined Carnage Clan. That just goes to show, guys, that anything is possible if you grind your most. You can gain 10,000 subs in a year. You can gain 100,000 subs in a year. You can join any team you want. You just gotta have the mental mindset to it and just go for it every day, day in and day out. So I hope you guys do enjoy that. A uh, little commentary, little speech there. Could not be more grateful to you guys. If you guys did like the video, please drop a like. Comment in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We're currently 500 subscribers away from 10,000. It's absolutely insane. Thank you guys so, so much. And we'll see you in the next video. Peace.